Hello everyone, I'm Kogi from Kogi.in and you're watching the review of Elphone P3000. This is a quad-co powered smartphone with 4G support. Here is the box pack and inside you'll find this handset, the Elphone P3000, a screen guard, user manual, data cable, travel charger and battery of 3150mAh capacity. The P3000 with key information on the factory fitted film and this is how it looks without the film. The handset does come with a factory fitted screen guard. 4G is supported but it will not work in India. The handset is bulky but comfortable to hold and it has got this sharp slope on the back side. The handset is available in black and white color options and it has got a matte finish on the back. There are three navigation buttons on the front bottom. And on the top, you'll find the camera, sensor, LED notification and in-call speaker. On the rear, there is the speaker out vent, L-Phone logo, 13 megapixel rear autofocus camera with LED flash and there is also the fingerprint scanner. Micro USB port and 3.5mm audio jack is placed on the top. Volume rockers are placed on the left side. Power button on the right and there is a mic at the bottom. There is a single mic. This is a dual SIM handset. SIM slot 1 is normal SIM. SIM 2 is micro SIM. And this is the micro SD card slot. It supports up to 64 GB cards. I have inserted the SIM and the SD card. Weight with battery is 149 grams. It is 9.91 mm thick. The breadth is 72.25 and the length is 144.09 mm. It sports a 5 inch screen with 1280 by 720 pixels resolution. Color reproduction is good and viewing angles are ok. The performance is good and the touch is smooth and responsive. The navigation buttons, they do not light up. Of the 8GB internal storage, you get around 1.7GB for apps and of the 1GB RAM, you get around 592MB free on the first boot. There is FM radio and native video calling is supported. This answer is powered by MediaTek MT6582 1.3 GHz quad core processor with Mali 400 MP GPU. It's running Android 4.4.2 with customized UI. This handset doesn't support the 4G band that works in India. There is built-in Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and GPS and Hindi language is supported. There is LED notification and you can also choose the LED color. Another unique feature about this handset is the fingerprint scanner. There is a fingerprint scanner on the rear side, just place your finger on it and move it down. You can register up to 3 fingerprints. OTG is supported. Here is the camera interface, zero shutter delay, voice capture, face detection, smile shot, HDR are supported. Rear camera is 13 megapixel with LED flash. It can shoot full HD videos. Front camera is 5 megapixel. Here is the model number, Android version and OTA updates are supported. The system is up to date. There are four sensors, accelerometer, proximity light and magnetic. The battery is at 86% and the temperature at 33 degrees. Quadrant benchmark score is 6310. Antutu score is 18428. Vilamo Metal 787 Multicore 1181 Browser 1718. There was some issue with Nina Mark 2. I got this blank screen and I had to restart the system. This handset supports 5-point multi-touch. After 26 minutes, the battery dropped by 4% and the temperature is 34 degrees. The time is 11.15, battery at 79% and the temperature at 34 degrees. I'm going to play this video shot using the same handset in a loop. Wi-Fi is on and I've set the brightness to the maximum. After 30 minutes, the battery dropped by 11% and the temperature is 36 degrees. Asphalt 8 got installed on the external storage. Set to the highest visual quality. Game is playable. I installed the Modern Combat 5 and I got the same issue that I faced with the Nina Mark 2 application as well as MX Player. I got a blank screen. I think it's a software glitch and it could be fixed easily by the company via software updates. I then played the Asphalt 8 for about 21 minutes. The battery dropped by 5% and the temperature is 34 degrees. The Elphone P3000 is powered by MediaTek quad-core processor. The performance is pretty good. 
Camera quality is really good, there is fingerprint scanner and the battery backup is about 7 to 10 hours on a single charge. Here are some of the extra accessories, you've got this leather pouch, it's artificial leather. And here is a nice looking flip cover with a circular glass on the front. You need to clip the handset on the flip case, it's of a good quality and it's magnetic. You'll get a nice clock on the flip screen when you close the flip. It looks good on the front side but on the back side it's transparent, plasticky. Elphone P3000 is available for $150. Visit my website to check sample images and videos and if you like this video do hit the like button and don't forget to share.